We know about sardine, mackerel, bully beef, chicken foot, chicken neck, chicken back. Nothing a waste, nothing a dash way. Wagwan, Wagwan, what's great? Chef Jan Morris again, man, presenting to you how to make fry eggs in three different forms. I'm here to help you better understand the difference with a over easy egg, over medium, and over hard. Because many a times, customers may see a next customer next to them order over easy egg, and you may not know what this is. If you're guilty of this, this is the video for you, and I hope this will help you in its entirety. You get your thing, and I say, what is the egg raw, the egg too hard, and because you never really know, you just hear the person next to you order and say, okay, I'm having what he's having or she's having. I'm going to be showing you how to make that so that when you go to the restaurant next time, you know exactly what you're getting, right? So, Fawn, let me show you what I'm going. So, the first thing you want is a non stick frying pan. We we'll put our heat on medium. This has been heating up for about a minute. So, we're going to add to that a knob of butter. We we'll allow that to melt. You don't want this overly hot, so ensure to keep your heat on medium. Alright, so we don't have to wait until that is entirely melted. We're just going to go in with the egg. Careful not to break the yolk. And watch as the egg white cargily. So the over easy eggs, we fry that for about 30 to 45 seconds. So the first 30 seconds as it is, when we flip it, we allow it to rest for 15 seconds. Just enough to seal the top off. And if you realize, the egg white is now set. What you want to do now, you want to get your frying pan and tilt it. Bring the egg right down to the end of the pan and then you're just going to gently flip the egg over. Just like that, not too hard, just so you don't break the yolk. And let that sit for about 15 seconds. Alright, so now the 15 seconds has passed, bring it back down to the end and flip again. Just like that. And then I'm just going to slide that right onto the plate. And that is your over easy. So again, gently with the egg. Ensure not to break the yolk. So this over medium egg will be frying for a minute and 45 seconds. So the first 55 seconds on one side. So it's going to bring that down to the end. And we're just going to flip that. Just like that. So what you're trying to achieve here is a firmer yolk. We're going to allow this to sit for 50 more seconds. Alright, so we're just going to flip that back over. Just going to wipe my frying pan clean. So a knob of butter again, and in with your over hard egg. So this is what we call in the Caribbean a fried egg. We cook the yolk all the way, so it's not runny. So this one now, we'll be cooking for two minutes and 15 seconds until we achieve that firm yolk. So the first minute on one side, let the flip side fry for another minute. So to speed up the frying of the yolk, you're just gonna get a fork and prick it. Flip it over and we leave that for 15 more seconds and it should be ready to go. So by pricking this with the fork, it allows the heat to go in the yolk and cook it to the texture that we want, right? Flip it over again. Sprinkle to taste with salt and pepper. Over easy. I'm gonna cut right into the yolk. Just separate that. And you see how runny that is. Some people like to eat their eggs like that. And then over this side now, we have the over medium. So for the over medium, we have a runny yolk. It's not as runny as the over easy. And here in the middle now, we have the over hard with no runniness at all. And there you have it. How to make your fried eggs here on Morris Time Cooking Ed. Once again, thank you very much for watching. Next time when you go out, you'll know exactly what to expect when you order your fried eggs. And do remember to hit that subscribe button. Until next time, see if travel on the gravel. I'm going big up on yourself. Yeah, me see you another dinner for later. But know you're fast, girl, you never tell me. Cause I know any, any man can feed you. So that's why you always take me to the kitchen. Yeah, yeah, yeah.